Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm filming this vampire Halloween makeup tutorial. So if you like the look, just keep on watching. I have my eyelids primed with Silk Talker Paint Pot from MAC and some loose white powder. Now I'm mixing some red over it and just applying it all over my crease with this Real Techniques brush. Now I'm using Keep Calm and Berry On from Essence in this purplish reddish shade and just applying it all over my crease again. By the way, if you're new to my channel and didn't notice, I'm using contacts from Solotica are the best contact ever. Now I'm using this kind of burgundy shade with this little shading color brush and I'm applying it in my crease. Back with the essence eyeshadow and I'm just buffing it away all over it just to blend everything in. Now I'm using this uh, studio makeup brush using the red matte shade I used before that it's also from Perfusion. Now I'm using the black one, just applying it in my crease but just in the end and slightly bringing it backwards. Then I'm using this Milani black eyeshadow but this is one of my favorites actually because it's really really black. And I'm applying it like applying eyeliner, just bringing it upwards and a little bit over my crease and then blending it with the Studio Makeup Brush and then blending it with the Real Techniques Brush. And now I'm just kind of applying eyeliner again just with eyeshadow and using this Essence Extreme Volume Mascara that is actually one of my favorite. Now boom I have eyelashes on from Echo Tools. For my eyebrows I'm using this Mica Beauty um, gel. Also with some gel eyeliner I did kind of a little bit of gel eyeliner and then I brought it to the tip of my eye down to my nose. Now I'm going in with foundation and I'm using Rimmel Stay Matte and this is the shade Ivory. Now here we are with Vampire Skin Tone. Now I'm using BH Cosmetics Round Brush with the Perfusion Contour Palette and I'm mixing the yellowish and the whitish powder. Now I'm going in with this BH Cosmetics Contour Brush with the darkest shade in the Provision Palette and I'm bringing the contour a little bit down to my chin just to make it look like I'm just really thin and dead. <laughs> I'm doing some contour in my jawline and down under my neck just to make it look, make my face look even more thin. Now I'm giving um, the bottom lip a little bit of volume, just using the darkest shade to contour it a little bit. Now I'm using these Elizabeth Arden red lipstick and I'm just weirdly going all over the edges but it doesn't matter it doesn't have to be perfect i'm just buffing it away with this eco tools brush just want to give the look like i've been drinking blood all night and it's all over my foundation and whatever because i'm a vampire that likes makeup of course
I'm just going in with the Profusion Red Matte Shade I used before and I'm going all over it where I put the lipstick and just buff it even more. Once we have that done, I'm going in with the red lipstick again but now I'm kind of lining my lips with it. Then I'm going in with this purple matte lipstick and I'm actually painting my lips with it. And by the way, I did use black eyelash glue to make those little fang bites over there. And then I will show you how to make them look even more like bites. I'm doing kind of a ombre lip, so I'm going in with this Profusion more um, reddish, maroonish shade and then just lining all over my lips with the matte purple shade. Then I'm using my finger to blend the edges a little bit. Now I'm back again with the red lipstick just in the middle of my lip to kind of give the look of fresh blood. Now to give it more dimension, I'm adding a little bit of gel black eyeliner in the bottom of my lip and also to make it more like smoky, like dirty. Now I'm using a flat brush just to smudge the edges of the gel eyeliner and bring it a little down to my nose. Then I'm just bringing it even more down to my nose and buffing it away with the little color brush that also has like purple um, eyeshadow on it so I'm kind of giving myself a nose contour now I'm going in with more black gel liner and bringing it even more down and then buffing it away with the color brush adding more red profusion matte eyeshadow this one is a little bit more pigmented than the other one I used before and I'm bringing it down to my nose with the other shades and the black gel liner then I'm back with the Milani black shade and I'm buffing it away in the under eye area with the Real Techniques brush I'm buffing away everything and blend everything in now fangs yeah now I'm using uh, the Milani black shade with this old Dior round little brush to just press it out don't really do anything else I want it to look deep and profound, like real bite. And then I'm using the red shade all around it and blend that in all around. Now, fake blood! Yay! Fun! Now I'm just trying to make it drip naturally. Yeah, something like that. Now, more fake blood in it, right in the center of the fake bite. Press um, the fake blood just to make it look deeper right in the center and then drip it all over make it messy make it fun it's Halloween um yeah and a little bit in my mouth just to make it look really creepy I guess and yeah like all around then I'm just highlighting because I'm a vampire but I still love highlighted girl so yeah I'm doing it but just in my cupid's bow. With all the other colors in my mouth, it turned gray. Yeah, it's grayish, but yeah, kind of Halloweenish. Yeah, and some uh, highlight in my lip too. And bam, sexy vampire. So yeah, if you like this tutorial, please give it a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe. And yeah, really thanks for watching and see you the next time. Bye!